Well, we're very excited for his 18th birthday when he moves to university and we get the house back. That's, that's super exciting. Um, but otherwise, you know, there'll be lots of firsts along the way, and but there'll also be lots of times where he falls and needs our support. So um, just to be there, you know, whatever shape that takes, I think. Have lots of patience, because they are going to drive you crazy. Yes, they are. Lots of patience. Take them to, you know, baseball games and play soccer and basketball and hockey and do all the things that dad would, would want to do with their, with their, their children. Um, I think playing catch at some point, that'll be pretty big. Doing the rough and tumble boy things with her and doing all the pretty dress up girl things with her as well. So, yeah, I think I would like her to play ball and wear fancy dresses. That's my goal for her. Basically, this is a really good Father's Day present because Father's Day is just a couple of days away. Well, I feel amazing. It's great. Can't get a better Father's Day present than this. A great Father's Day gift for me, a great Father's Day gift for Ron, Melissa's dad, his first uh, little grandchild, and a great gift for my dad, first grandchild in 30 years. So, uh, yeah, so I'm uh, pretty excited about that. Yeah, I'd like to wish everybody who was a father a happy Father's Day and to enjoy their day with their children. That's what it's all about, right? It's all about you. Happy Father's Day, especially to big Cecil out there and Ron and me. But happy Father's Day to everybody else. From little Marlos, right? So, uh, happy Father's Day um, for all the new dads and old dads alike. Um, I remember when I was there on the other side of this, wishing my dad a Father's Day and how much it meant. And I think it's only going to mean more going forward.